Hi YouTube, welcome to my channel, it's Miss Direction and I'm coming to you with updates about my hair. Last time I took a video for you, I had a sewing weave and then this week I have braids. Well, let me tell you about that. I kept the weaving for four weeks, three weeks, six days and then I decided like, bye bye weave, I'm tired. I needed to wash my hair, my head was sweaty. I hadn't actually washed my hair in the four weeks I kept the weaving because I was using the dark and ugly waterless scalp wash and then plus we had power outages like three days in a row and then so there was like a lot of sweat and then I just felt really uncomfortable so bye weave, hello my hair and let me tell you I had progress like like I had a lot of like I felt like I had some growth okay in a way, I felt like my hair was short, but when I looked at the pictures, like, over and over, I'm like, dang girl, your hair is coming up nicely, and then my family, and then my WhatsApp groups, and then the people I communicate with about my hair, they kept telling me, like, damn, Nisa, what are you doing to your hair? So, like, I'm like, well, Nisa is getting hair. Yeah, so, after I took out my weave, I decided to burn my hair for the week and then like just allow my hair time to rest before um, getting the braids. I kept the burning for four days without touching or moving it. I just scarfed it every night and it looked fine. And let me tell you, it was a bun with my own hair, no donut, no hair sock, like my hair and it was almost perfection. But then I realized that my nape needs some work. So I'm going to start applying JBCO on my nape area almost daily, if I can't remember. So, I got braids. Also, because I'm 17 weeks post relaxer, so I can't be combing my hair all the time. Like, I'm going to comb the life out of my hair, and I don't feel prepared to relax. So I decided to get braids. Just for 3 to 4 weeks, to keep my hair safe, in a way, because once my hair is out, it's going to, like be another story altogether and I decided to start co-washing I hate co-washing I tried it once I didn't like it my hair didn't feel clean like you're saying co-washing but then my hair didn't feel washed or anything it just felt like I had smothered my hair in more product and then my hair felt way down and stuff but then I got this it's the VO5 tea therapy clarifying conditioner with vanilla and mint tea and Maybe this might change my perception about co-washing. I decided to get this because it's a clarifying conditioner. I'm not going to use instant conditioner on my hair to co-wash. So I'm just hoping that this is going to work for me. I plan on co-washing my hair every week and shampooing my hair every two weeks. So then like time will tell because I'm unpredictable. I can co-wash once and decide I don't like it and I won't do it again. So I'll just let you all know what happens with that. Yeah, I'm going to post pictures at the end so you can see my progress or in between the videos, it depends on how I edit the video, but like, you see pictures of my progress, you see pictures of my bun. And yeah, leave a comment, subscribe, like, no, subscribe, like, <laughs> and 